guy, bro. He big. He was fighting dirty. Elbows, headbutts. But of course, not Pacquiao winning almost every round. It's not a close fight. What did you guys think? All the way. You know, he's putting a lot of work. 23 years. Eighth division world champion. Yes. It's gotta be Pacquiao. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we'll see. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh, my god. Oh, my god. Oh, my god. Oh, my Thing, bro. Disgusting, bro. Wow, you're in No! Oh! Boy, Boxy's oh, correct. I can do a 115, 113. Back, yeah. Oh! Manny didn't deserve that, man. I would have cried my ass off. I'm not even gonna lie to you, man. Think about it. They want another fight. Who else is gonna fight? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. But they did him dirty, you know. We talking about a legend who fought through two bad headbutts, a headbutt in the elbow, fought his ass off. Yo, I don't know. Oh! Damn, why they play Pacquiao and give this man the belt? This man did not win that fight. Disgusting, that's a legend. They, they disrespect him right now. 117, 111. Man, Stephen A. Smith was even talking about how good Pacquiao's doing, what he's doing in my last fight, this is sad. Oh. That wasn't even close. Why? That wasn't even close. Oh, shit! What the fuck? What? Oh, my God! Oh! They gave a trophy, a win, a huge win, to horn the local kid for trying hard. You're not supposed to get it for trying hard. You're supposed to get it for winning. If you go by the real rules, the markers of Queensberry rules, who lands the cleaner punches? You have to do a lot more to win a decision, unanimous decision, against the champ, though. You have to do a lot more than that. Ooh. Controversy, a lot of people, Pacquiao winning widely. I mean, he, he's still proven to be an incredibly talented fighter. Pacquiao got robbed, you know that. Decision where it was an absolute disgrace. They robbed them. Robbery. They need my glasses, two magnifying glasses and some ethics. From what I understand, many won. Let's see the next fight. You, know, you, can't, you can't judge it by one fight. Yeah. Did you see him in the fight? Yes, yes. I think he's been one. One? Yeah, one. I think he's won this one. Ah, se les... Eh, como se la robaron? They robbed him? They robbed him. Did you watch that fight? Yes, I did. I was shaking my head based on the decision. I, let me tell you, I gave Pacquiao at least nine rounds, eight easy, but there's no way in the world that Pacquiao lost that fight. No way in the world. Pacquiao won. Pacquiao won. He clearly won the fight. No, Yobi ganara a Manny Pacquiao. Okay. So the referee called the fight. In the corner, he started screaming and yelling, and then he let the fight go on. So that's the referee's inexperience. Like, increíble. No más faltaba que hiciera en la esquina Jeff Horn. Yo, Adrian. Uh, got him so the referee even came at the end of the ninth round and said, Look, as you clearly see, Pacquiao walked his ass. He had this guy basically crippled. Because Jeff went to the hospital. Because he was, you know, he got busted up a bit. When people get in the ring with Manny, they come out different. And the ref even threatened to stop the fight. You know, I've been maintaining the admiration of Pacquiao as a peleador, as a person, and as everything. It sucks that, like, boxing is just this corrupt to where, like, you know, we're still just getting robbery after robbery left and right, and it's, it's not even surprising anymore. It's kind of sad. Be back ringside, and incredibly, we're with both. Listen, congratulations, great effort. I thought you lost. I thought this guy was landing the punches. You were throwing a lot that were missing, but you showed great heart. The heart of a champion. Thank you. You're an absolute legend, mate. Thank you. Thanks, mate. This is bullshit.
That's some bullshit, bro. Hey, I know. Pacquiao, they done you wrong, man. They done you wrong. I mean, he was fighting hard, but a lot of shots wasn't landing. You know, Pacquiao was more precise. Understand. Because I need to see Jeff Horn's aggressive action as being effective action. He fought good, though, man, but no. Damn, I just feel like they stole that one from my boy, man. I, I thought he won, bro. Uh, my opinion was he won, loud and clear. This has to be a screw up. No way Jeff Horn won this fight. How do you give that fight a horn? I'm disgusted. He did not deserve to lose. How rigged that fight was. Uh, Pacquiao, his punches was a lot cleaner, right? He, he landed twice as many punches as the other guy. You won that fight, Pacquiao. Yeah, it's a damn shame they did that. Not only did you win the fight, you whooped that dude's ass. Manny Pacquiao looked slow. Manny Pacquiao looked like he was in a situation where he didn't uh, handle his business. But at the end of the day, after I scored it, I still scored it 7-5 Pacquiao. I do feel sorry for Manny, man. He didn't deserve that. That was uh, BS how he got treated, man. So uh, I don't think there's any question that Pacquiao won that fight. I don't think he looked his best by any means, but he still won the fight. Um, I didn't think he won the fight. I thought Pacquiao won the fight. I thought Pacquiao won. You know, I, I, I actually... When I, while I was scoring the fight in real time, I remember I was saying to myself, well, I'm going to try to give Jeff Horn as many rounds as I can. And many, many people's eyes, uh, back up one. Uh, some people said he got ripped off. What's Yo, your thoughts? Yo, some bullshit. It's a whole bunch of bullshit. A lot of bullshit behind the scenes, too, so. Con esa edición para mí fue una edición más mala que yo he visto en el boxeo en los últimos años. I really think many won. It was a very competitive fight. But I really think many won the fight. De eso a que se tenga que retirar, eh, fue lamentable lo que ha sucedido en Australia para él, eh, que haya sido objeto de un robo cuando todos lo vimos ganar. Pacquiao went to Australia and fought, and now he got Pacquiao's head. Did he beat Pacquiao? Hell no. They announced a Jeff Horn one, Rob, maybe one of the biggest robberies of the year. This is bullcrap, Pacquiao won at least eight rounds, plus a 10-8 round. Y al final de cuentas, lo que vimos fue algo bastante... Uh, the result was an uh, absolute disgrace. Well, for a start, Pacquiao landed lots more punches, which is presumably the way you score the fight. Um, I don't particularly trust punch stats, but when it's uh, two to one in favor of somebody, I don't think they can that be that far off the beam. Definitivamente no hubo la, la certeza por parte de los jueces y eso vuelve a lastimar. Robbed Manny Pacquiao of a clear victory. Uh, one of them only gave Manny Pacquiao three Fucking round. Aún al punto de los jueces es triste que un deporte como el boxeo esté cayendo. A veces no tienen vergüenza con lo que hacen. That's kind of why boxing fans get so upset sometimes at boxing because when somebody pulls off a victory that clear, I don't know what else you want from a man, you know? That's a beautiful thing about the free market when things are bullshit, like boxing has been for a long time. UFC comes in, entrepreneurs, and take over the game. I think it was a bad decision. I, I, I think it was a bad decision, but that's boxing. Did, did Manny Pacquiao win? No. But you had Jeff. <laughs> oh, he might have won two rounds. Might have. I, I had it seven to five for Manny. I thought what. he was, but. Well, there was plenty of blood spilled in the ring. There were the uh, multiple head clashes and the shot to the eye early on as well. Let me ask. But all over the social media, they're going crazy. They actually consider this a major steal. They took this away from Manny Pacquiao. He was expected to take this by a knockout in the first couple of rounds. He didn't comply with that. He looked very slow, and I'm almost hating to say he looked old. Do you think that, 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 that Connor can really beat Floyd Mayweather? Pacquiao just got beat by a school teacher. So yeah, yeah, I think Don't Connor. you really do? Okay, that's where I was gonna go. I, the I was, judges that beat Pacquiao. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Pacquiao I mean, won, but I agree. <laughs> I, I agree with that too, but, but so, you know but, what? Yeah, what's the name? Jeff Horn. Jeff Horn? Yep. No one gave Jeff Horn a chance. A school teacher was bullied. Like you, look, man, look at You wanna fight my punches landing. Look, man, you say what you wish. I'm telling you, this guy beat the shit out of Pacquiao. You think so? Nah. It was, uh, nobody believed that Pacquiao was going to lose to the guy named Horn, neither. Um, I thought Manny won seven rounds. Oh, seven. my God. Seven to five? Yeah. It nothing, man, five. That's it, man. That's one fight. Any damn body should be able to see this. 
to be honest, mm -hmm. skill set wise, experience, everything, I can go down a list. I mean, it's, it's, there's no chance for McGregor. Okay. <laughs> I want to see a raise of hands and how many of you media members pick Jack Horn? You pick Jack Horn. Yeah. <laughs> Ain't no more Pacquiao. I didn't expect that. <laughs>117-111. Yeah, believe it or not, I've had a, a lot of people on social media tell me they thought Horn won. The rhetoric of robbery, corruption, this is one of the worst decisions I've ever seen. That's powerful stuff. And when you have that many people watching, but he won the fight. He landed the clear, the cleaner, better punches. But it wasn't a robbery. Boxing trying to push you out. Nah, man. But you know the sport. You watch this sport, you can't be that incompetent. You see who's landing clean, who's just throwing, who's not landing clean, who almost got knocked out. You can't be that incompetent. So what else could it be? Corruption. I don't have the three names and a mugshot of each of those officials for the crime that they committed by robbing Manny Pacquiao tonight. Cannot believe Manny Pacquiao got jobbed the way that he did tonight. I can't believe it. It's kind of like the old days. Remember the comic books and you had the cloud over his head? Yeah, yeah. Thought of what he really was saying? <laughs> I'm saying, he's saying, they robbed the crap out of me. He's <laughs> praying in pieces. <laughs> but I saw that thought bubble, so I figured I'd do it for him. Yeah. <laughs> so when I interviewed Jeff Horn and he said I was going in there to bully Pacquiao and this one. You might never hold him home. You might not even go home. So I take it really serious. La misma junta que, que, que ordina el asunto del deporte alrededor de Manny Pacquiao en Sarangani, en el Senado, le pide a Manny Pacquiao que sí genere una protesta directa con la Organización Mundial de Boxeo. De tal manera que Manny Pacquiao dice, quiero rescatar al mundo del boxeo, no quiero que este deporte muera porque es el deporte que me ha hecho a mí. What I and many people in the world deem as corruption and the WBO rescored. Basically, the WBO stated that Jeff Horn still won this fight. Jeff Horn's father. Jeff Horn's even Judge Rolden, who scored the fight 117, 111, validated by the five review judges. Because I've just heard that they already reviewed it again. The same results was that he won. Exactly. And, and Pacquiao said the same thing after the fight that he thought he had lost. So. Fuck you! Fuck you, fuck you! Fuck you! So they, they, they were not using the Marcus of Queensbury rules that boxing was founded upon where it clearly states that, you know, it's all about clean and effective punching. Nobody was happy about the decision except Jeff Horn. Nobody. Oh, Bob Earl probably liked it. Older. <laughs> Were you disappointed in the referee's performance or any of the officials? I know the referee did a hell of a job. Bullshit. Jeff Horn says he's lost respect for American boxing commentator Teddy Atlas. WBO's rescore of the controversial bout was awarded to Horn today. Probably be avoiding conversation with Teddy, Teddy Atlas if I if I could. I'm Thank you, Webby.
through those crowds of people. Um, yeah, the noise was crazy. Of course, round nine. And he got clipped, and he got clipped again, and many just sort of started cutting loose. Oh, starts landing big left hands rapidly, in quick succession. And I was wobbled and cut. I was backing off because I knew I needed that time to just stay away, because if that accumulation of shots is what stops you in these fights. And I'm watching the referee, what's he thinking, because the referee can stop the fighters, you know, at any point in time. And he was just getting punched, and he just kept moving back, moving back, and, and he'd just get punched in his head. And, oh, when you see that, when you see that of the person, you just think, oh, it's so scary. I haven't seen him like that. It was horrible, and I was like, I don't care, end the fight, who cares? Just just get him out of there. Please just throw him in the towel, you know? This is so scary. The referee's over in the face, and the first thing he says is, I think he's had enough. And then he says, you know, you need to show me something. If you don't show me something, I'm going to stop the fight. And I was like, oh, I'll show you something, all right. <laughs> OK, Jeffrey's back. I just threw everything I could at the pack here. Talking. No more the talking. New World champion is here. Whoa. Champion of the world. Yeah. Yeah, sit down. Sit down. Thank you. Feel feel on cloud nine at the moment. Feel a bit tired, a bit bruised, but feel like a winner. <laughs> <laughs> you are one. <laughs> <laughs> Like a group, but like a <laughs> Yesterday I said today would be Sunday, bloody Sunday, uh, and I just knew, I just knew I could see, see in my eye. One one seven to one one eleven, uh, one eleven. Were you surprised by the? The, the margin of victory for you, uh, according to the judges? Uh, no, not really. I, I was happy that I'd won the fight. I'm just stoked that I'd won it. This is cheering me on and congratulating me, me and my beautiful wife, Joanna. There is no doubt. Congratulations. it all into it and I showed that yesterday how much I wanted it and I got that win. The face is actually feeling pretty good if I don't touch it so. <laughs> well primero que todo, uh, Horn ya es famoso. <laughs> Jeff Horn is a bigger name than all the PBC welterweights. Oh my god. Que si fuera una trampa para Pacquiao. Lo hacen ir a Australia, chingue, ¿me entiendes? Bob Arum is stable, mate, but uh, I think he was a bit set up there. Have you seen Jeff Horn fight before? Uh, I, I didn't see him. Had you, have you heard of him before there was talk about... Pacquiao against Joe Horn. Now, I know Joe Horn is a respectable guy and what Jeff, have you, but what Jeff, you think... Jeff, Jeff, Jeff. Jeff, Jeff, I apologize. Yeah, very excited to fight... Um, um, What's his boy's name? Horn. Look, your last fight was a huge success on ESPN. Right. We expected Manny Pacquiao to play with Jeff Horn, and what happened was a robbery in my eyes. For Manny Pacquiao, dalawang linggo matapos ang issue tungkol kay top rank CEO Bob Arum. It was a close fight. I was there. I got in the ring after the fight, and I had Manny winning by one point. Right. I had it six rounds to six rounds. I say Horn is the best MMA fighter in boxing. Where's this fight at? Australia. Wait a minute. Where's this dude from? Australia? He was undefeated and Pacquiao was going to his home country of Australia to fight him, right? And it was a huge money fight, right? Why would he, why would he say no to that? I was telling you that it's going to be a physically tough fight for Pacquiao, that he's going to win, but it's going to be a grueling physical fight, right? And what happened? Exactly. The last fight you lost against Jeff Horn. People say, of course, that you actually won that fight. Yes. But then aren't you nervous that your record will be tarnished by, you know what I mean? 
Do it, man. To get out with his health, I think that's that's of prime importance to me as as his dad. What concerns us is the small injuries to the brain that come with each blow uh, to the head. There's a high rate of uh, dementia, uh, but also problems with mobility, and the more boxing that you do, uh, I think the greater the risk there's going to be. I've had cases where I can't remember what I did that day, that night, and I'm like, why? And is it because I'm just so busy, or is it because I've been hitting the head too many times? spilled in the ring there were the uh, multiple head clashes and a shot to the eye early on as well and the officiating was terrible the referee was a disgrace i mean the the mauling and butting and back of the head punch it's an awkward guy bro he's big he's fighting dirty elbows headbutt jeff horn made it into an ugly fight you know he hit him on top of the head he put his weight on him any chance he got oh boys throw the elbows Esos eh, golpes ilegales que tuvo, que no fueron pocos. Damn dude, hit button the fuck out your ass. I think the ref did a terrible job tonight, trying to tie him up, but then Horn will push his head down and literally just put him in a headlock and hold that headlock for about three, four seconds and didn't get a warning, didn't get a point taken away. He bashed his ass on this side. He came back next round. Dude came in and bashed the fuck out of right here. The referee was just terrible. There's you know, elbows and things. And the one that did a really bad job there was a referee. The referee didn't do nothing. He didn't do shit. You know, just nothing. He hit him on top of the head. He came in with headbutts any way he can. This is horn, man. God damn! Headbutts all night long. The horn kept holding him. Did a couple of things that was kind of bullyish or dirty, holding him and hitting him. He was leading with his head. He was doing a whole lot of bowing. He, he was fighting dirty. They, they, he, they shouldn't let him fight that dirty. Es claro que Mark Nelson, el referee, no actúa eh, como debe actuar un hombre que tiene que cuidar eh, la salud del boxeador, las lesiones eh, que, que son generadas por los cabezazos de Jeff Horn y también por los codos. He had some dirty tactics that would even give Andre Ward a run for his money. Were you disappointed in the referee's performance or any of the officials? I know the referee did a hell of a job. Yesterday I said today would be Sunday, bloody Sunday. Uh, and I just knew, I just knew I could still Mark, you're, uh, you're in Australia, Brisbane, Australia, to uh, referee Manny Pacquiao and Jeff Horn fight. That's your last time. Correct. Well, this is a standout fight for me uh, tonight. I mean, it is this three... the first Manny Pacquiao fight? It is the first Manny Pacquiao fight. And uh, you just treat it like any other fight. You know, it's you get in there and you just, you just do your job. And OK, thank you. Enjoy.